Hello, everybody. I decided to sparkle up my life a little bit and work a little bit on this beautiful tiger, which is my little girl supposed to do this tiger, but she decides she has enough already. And I'm gonna do it. So I already placed some beads, as you can see. I do it by color first. So here is how much I did a little bit on this side there you go and in here so I'm gonna do right now together with you we're gonna do what this I have 11 as a D so we're gonna do D and I do by color so I'm looking at that's why I like the clear sheet because I see where to place my beads so I already laying up this beautiful beautiful drills okay light 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 move a little bit lamp maybe okay because uh, okay see so we're not gonna have good enough light because I'm right now it's late so I'm, I have no daylight only my light kind of from the table and from the top but it's usually a little bit darker than i like to record video but if i don't record video now by tomorrow i think gonna be finished this one so i will never <laughs> drill with you and it seems like you guys like this kind of videos especially with special drills so let me see how much we can zoom and adjust adjust camera so we can see there so I have in here D looks like it's gonna be okay okay so I'm doing this video same day as I posted my video about the resin tutorial for beginners. So guys, I don't know, did you watch that yesterday? Because this video you're gonna watch obviously next day after my resin tutorial. And I had fun playing with this resin. I totally hook on it. And I'm ordering more molds, resin molds, that way I'm gonna have a nice and shiny resin um, cast, so it's not like, not foggy, but would be nice and shiny. So if you didn't see the video, please look, see, maybe you like to do the same craft. Okay, I don't know if this is gonna be a noise, you guys, did I make the noises with this paper? Okay, let me try to turn around this way. And this way you're not gonna see, hold on. Okay, I need to move camera. there now about this particular um, about this canvas uh, the glue is movable too so it's easy to move if you place a little bit not straight or wrong color well humans we can do different colors place I did that many times so it's easy to move them around this is really good canvas and I have been working like on two canvases at the same time okay something stuck to my pen something fiber um, what I want to say 
I'm working at the same time on two canvases. One of them my angel. And the angel is a little bit harder canvas to work with because the icon is dark. And for example, in this time of the day, when there's no daylight, it's really hard to kind of read the icon because the canvas is dark and these symbols on the dark squares as well and some of them is very uh, look alike. So I'm just like, okay, I'm gonna do my tiger first. And after doing the canvas from Brand Ambassador as I am for the Dreamers design, that canvas was so easy to paint that I kind of like got a little bit uh, withdrawal, I would say. <laughs> after I finished, I was like, oh, now after that canvas to go to the other one that I already drilled, it's so much harder because the quality is totally different. So I'm just gonna do a little bit sparkle. I miss sparkle and I was hoping my little girl gonna stick to it and do it. But she decided not to. So I say, okay, I'm gonna do it by myself if you don't want to. So she's like, okay, you can do it. I just really want a tiger. If And she said, if I wouldn't say I want a tiger, you wouldn't buy it. What a little stinker she is. So I got this and now I have to drill. Uh-uh, too much. Okay. We still in focus that way. I like when camera is a little bit more close that way. You can see exactly where I place my drills. And also you can see my perfection or unperfection, if it's straight or not. Oh, I miss gems. I miss sparkle. Okay, we are moving to here. I just want to make sure we in camera reach. So last night I was cleaning my craft room. As far as I clean, that's how far I can make a mess in five minutes. And I mean not just like mess to make it dirty, but if something is not right for me and access to some craft not as clear as I would love to, I will move all room around to change stuff around to make sure it's more accessible. So that's what I did last night. I was doing my beads, uh, the jewelry beads. Uh, I changed a little bit shelf and around and reorganized stuff and I still have a lot of things to do but I, I mean I place everything on the shelf and I just have to kind of go through each little container and maybe reorganize some beads because when I started my beads addiction I bought them mostly like at the dollar store and some cheap store um, or even in some liquidation stores and as I grow and learn more I start to buy lots of beads at Michael's craft store so of course the beads were more expensive more beautiful more natural beads not just a cheap plastic oops lost the bead not a cheap plastic okay I think I need a little bit hold on guys I keep messing on a bead I need a little bit rewax I need some new wax. Okay. Now I'm just using a, this container. 
I do have a cute container from my Dreamers design, but this one kind of was already with my beads I started with, so that's why I'm just using a one wax. Okay, where we are here, 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 there. So I was cleaning, cleaning for a long time. And then I remember there was a live show, live stream with Dreamer Design Ambassador Kaylin and I totally lost time and I just watched reply a replay later. But of course I miss all the fun to talk to you ladies. Sometimes I can like just when I start to do something, I lose my time because I'm so into it, whatever I'm doing. Okay, so that's how I do. I turn in my canvas around. I peel the other side. There. Okay, maybe this is too close. Okay. And I'm gonna do in here. Now I do have a request to do a uh, really diamond painting with those sunflowers that I unpacked a long time ago and didn't have time to drill yet because there's always different diamond painting kind of in line and I did make um, kind of commitment to do video this week and I already last night put some drills together and organized to get ready to the diamond painting and this morning I read actually request to do the diamond painting so I was like, well, just in time, because I am dying to see the diamond painting by myself, because that's the other one that is really beautiful canvas, and that should be really good quality, good quality canvas and good quality beads. So that should be a really good diamond painting to drill, but it has lots of black. Uh, black beads so that's kind of little I guess pushing me away those black beads I never kind of like to work because it's dark canvas so I definitely need to work on that one with daylight I don't like to use a light pad it's covering and I cannot see colors like true color um, but uh, guys, as I um, said before about, I will ask in the other company, okay, are we in camera? Um, I ask, uh, what's the company, hold on, Wizardy, Wizardy Art, uh, they used to ship kind of like, you guys couldn't find, a, remember the Telephone Boost T-Holder 3D uh, diamond painting? There is on the wood pieces, like a plywood. So I did uh, have respond on that one that you can buy those pieces and they sell to public. Um, and I will link for you under this video. Also, I will add the link to my original unboxing video and to the telephone booth because um, the person comment uh, on one of my videos and say that you guys can purchase at their site so that's kind of good news so far so please check it out it just uh, up there you need to look uh, just look around because uh, they have a diamond painting and other stuff also there is a 3d um, project so if you're looking for something cute like that, 
check it out. Now when you shake your tray, make sure you cover your sheet cover back just for in case you're gonna spill and the drills will stuck to your canvas. I always cover up. Okay. And now we're gonna continue. Okay, right in here it's a big patch in here, so I think I'm gonna try and use a little bit of the three drills. I love jams. I'm looking today at AliExpress site and I want to find more of this uh, sparkle gems canvases and I came across one store and I posted in my Facebook group Diamond Painting for All Ages link to the store uh, but I never ordered from that store yet so don't trust my word all I posted is that there's something new store that have a whole bunch of, of this uh, special shape diamond painting canvases uh, and I'm not sure if they all um, kind of partial because of the special shaped or if they have full or not I did not check all the way that store but uh, if you in my group check it out there's a link up there I think there is more and more companies start to bring this uh, special gems because they are very popular and most wanted I guess and you know by the way not everybody like the full drill canvas of sparkle beads uh, somebody like just like a accent of something uh, not the whole thing me the more sparkle than better you know me I'm like the bird that looking for shiny stuff I don't know I love everything sparkle so I think I will Drill this diamond painting tonight as long as I can. Um, depends. We just watched movie Harry Potter, Miss My Little Girl, and we already uh, watch all of them. I think it's six or seven movies. Uh, we got a DVD, a whole collection in one case, and she loves Harry Potter and we watch all of them and today she's like do you want to watch Harry Potter again oh boy okay so we started again over we watch first movie today and tomorrow she's probably gonna say let's watch another one same as Transformer uh, Bumblebee Transformer the one I have actually diamond painting up uh, that movie I watch with my son. My little girl no, don't like it, Transformers. So me and Ivan, my son, we watch that movie together. Oh, look at this, sticking out back. So we watch the movie together. Okay. This area here. So, which movie do you like to watch? Romantic, love stories, scary movie. I don't know, lately, you know what I'm watching lately on YouTube or even on TV? Cops show. Or like Life PD or. Uh, speed chase on YouTube. I usually watch the speedy speed chase uh, criminals uh, life 
live show of, no how's it called the channel I can't remember but I don't know why but I like to watch that and I was like sit drill my canvas at the same time and I watch speed chase watching how those bad guys or bad ladies sometimes chasing a car, stealing a car and they try and run away like how can you run away if a helicopter on the top of you watching every your move and just said sometimes they do so many crashes on the road for innocent people Dry responsible live longer And uh, this last Wednesday, I waited new series of Survivor. <gasps> Guys, I forgot. And my little girl remind me before that. She said, like, Mom, don't forget your show tonight. And I said to her, yes, please remind me a little bit later. It was like two hours away yet. And little by little, I did some diamond painting. Then I went with my son to the bedroom. We watched on his TV Transformer. And I forgot about my show. Oh my god. So I missed the first episode of new series of The Survivor. Now I have to wait all the way to next week, next Wednesday. And hopefully remember that because that's the only show kind of I like to watch on TV I don't know I love who else like to watch Survivor it's fun I would totally go on that show I can survive in a wild no problem food for me is not a problem and I can find food I could even fish food the only I would not agree it's a uh, slither and snakes or spiders up there falling on your head. Ooh, that would be nasty. Also, I really want to start to drill a little bit on my Wizardy Mermaid um, Mermaid canvas. She looks so pretty. It's like stainless glass canvas made. Beautiful. Maybe on the end of this video I'm going to show you a little bit of the, how much progress I made so far on my canvas from the Angel, Elf Angel by Nashella UK. It's going to take, yeah, it's going to take me a while to do the canvas by Nashella UK because of the canvas, uh, well it's, it's not very easy to make because of the dark symbols and i show you a little bit later okay are we in camera? okay i'm just so glad guys that right now i don't have to worry about my camera shot and video on me because it's only good for 23 minutes and 40 seconds or something because now I can edit these pieces together in my computer program that is actually in my computer and I didn't know that for a long time so now I'm just like okay whatever is first episode stops I'm just gonna record 
second one and then can edit together and then upload to YouTube channel and for some reason I don't know what is going on but when I try to add this two video together that certain program even in the middle of my connecting videos together the computer would start to restart by itself and I cannot change it I was like I was almost I thought I figured out I did some I watched tutorial on YouTube how to change settings on window computer to make sure computer doesn't restart forever he wants but the time when I want so I did that and I was like yes finally I'm not gonna screw up my computer uh, I mean my videos anymore because it's so frustrating especially it takes for so long time to connect these two videos together sometimes like hours and all of a sudden if it's not finished and computer decided to restart the file wouldn't be not saved and you lost everything and I have to redo all the way around again that just drive me nuts and again yes it's happened today for some reason I start to think that this program triggering to restart my computer because how this could be in a world happening every time I do a new video computer would restart I pull in my hair here mad as hell you wouldn't believe it yes I can get mad on that one because it just happens way too often and it happened today again after I just told my little girl watch it's probably my computer gonna restart right now because of course I'm uploading a new video sure enough two minutes not even computer restarted and I have to do everything together again so that was annoying I don't know I have to check my settings again unless whatever I did my changes computer didn't save that maybe I didn't save accidentally and I just keep restarting forever I want okay this area there Oh, I miss my gems. And guys, remember, I still have this huge canvas with the gems that I did not start yet. The one that I already made one, but didn't have enough uh, gems to finish. And when I sorted out colors of those gems, the big uh, garden side view, I think it's called, uh, as I call cottage, this new canvas that I got it from Pretty Neat Creation Creative, they don't have as many colors, so it definitely will be different looking. And I would love to see the comparison of two of them, because one is from AliExpress and one from Pretty Neat Creative. Um, and I think they still have that diamond painting up there, which it is expensive but the quality definitely better and I can tell that by the beads that's why right now I don't try to I don't try to finish my old one diamond canvas uh, with this extra beads from my new one because they are gonna be different on a quality so I will finish my new canvas first and if beads left, then I will place them to my old one canvas to finish because it is missing, missing beads. And those tulips, guys, my tulips canvas uh, that is not finished. A little bit of the color missing because it was sent wrong beads, right? So yesterday I emailed to the owner of that store and I said that I still do not receive my drills did you send them out he said yes it's sent just wait a little longer so i guess this is the case that you have to wait like two months 
because they usually they ship as slowest as a turtle shipping when it's not a canvas but just a missing drill they ship and always so long so I still did not receive but he saying that he did send out them so guys I'm still waiting on those and I will give you updates when I receive them so make sure uh, you know just to make sure the store is kind of responsible for their messes and would love to receive those beads to finish my canvas so I'm not in a hurry to place whatever beads you know like different kind of beads I still want to have original colors and hopefully they will met okay guys why didn't you yell on me that I'm already out of the focus ay 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 okay Okay, where we are here, 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 there, this patch. I'm sorry. I have to look more often on camera. Okay, also I have a good news for those who like um, jewelry beads. I'm putting together all my uh, items for the tutorial to do beautiful project. I did guys the video before and my file got accidentally erased and I lost that video so I'm kind of like trying to do all over again which is really annoying because I, I can like waste my time by doing it and got deleted okay I am here I wish I can hear you if I should drill this canvas only with you so you can enjoy more sparkles or I should just finish by myself it's gonna be hard for me to wait Usually, with the sparkle beads, I don't really like to use multi-placer because I enjoy place these gems one by one just because of the sparkles, you know, I want kind of like last longer but sometimes if I want to do get faster to new color then I place with three. Okay, we're gonna move. Uh, where are we gonna move? To the edge a little bit. Hold on. There. We're gonna do here.
How many of you guys purchase diamond paintings from new company Dreamers Design? I see lots of you. Many of you not agree, especially if you're Canadian, it's kind of expensive. And I agree it's expensive. But also it is beautiful. Beautiful. Not everybody like it though. Some criticize design that doesn't look like real. Which I explained that is not picture taken from the real pictures. I mean real scan. But it's from the painting. From the artist painting with the oil, you know. Oil painting. Diamond paint was made of. So they look like exactly as art not exactly as nature would look like in real life so I don't know not everybody understand I guess that and criticize artists that it is not good enough I cannot believe it actually kind of make me sad for that artist that people criticize them that doesn't look like real but if somebody would do a cartoon thing that is totally not real, yeah, they would like that. I don't know. There's always some lovers and some haters. Okay, where we are here, this corner. And then I'm gonna show you how much I did already on my canvas, uh, my angel. I'm gonna show you how much I did already. So, I'm just going to finish this little patch in here. I don't want this video to be too long for you. Just for in case if you have to go and watch other YouTuber video. I don't want to be greedy and keep you all here. Or should I? <laughs> I feel like I know you all for so long time. And with many of you become so good friends make me happy I like friends and I wish I can like one day we can get together and meet each other in real life wouldn't be amazing to have a humongous humongous craft room and diamond paint together okay train here And I go go around and then would be uh, um, then I kind of finish go on the side of tiger's nose see so we did like all the way around here and then I have left in here where is all those whites these uh, and a little bit in here so I'm gonna put this beads away and I'm gonna show you how much I did already my angel and I do same thing by the colors all the way around so you might not gonna see much but at least I'm gonna show you that I'm working on it and I kind of planning to drill with you together um, here it is. See, we see all the sparkles a little bit where I placed the beads. It's already, I like the blue eyes. Hmm. The green eyes would be ice, uh, nice too. Okay, so I'm gonna change position of my. I may be just gonna grab my camera. Okay, just a minute. Um, okay. Hold on guys, I will be right back. Okay, I'm gonna show you how much I did already on my angel. So as you can see, I start to see her face. And as you can see, I did, um, let me just even up my camera. 
well th this corner mostly done I still have uh, empty spaces um, I wanted to see her face so I kind of start place some beads a little bit up there but the thing is I came a little bit with the problems so I kind of you see this line of glue sticking out and I already cut with my um, exacto knife and just keep kind of that wrinkle stubborn doesn't want to go away I even kind of like a rub with my pen it feels like it's go away but then it's coming out again uh, so this beads probably gonna be popping in here and the more I drill I kind of see more of those lines some of them bigger some of them smaller um, so I will have to fix this one as I did my other one so I'm not really worried see like you can see the glue sticking out and what I'm talking about uh, like see that's the dark colors that's really hard to do at night because you can see better on camera right now but if I look um, for example in here was like H and a B with the same background with same white writing that is really really sim similar so it's like in here was would be like six and eight and a B which is all similar so I really need more time to look or like was uh, this was three and this is two and they was on the same dark background so which is very similar at the same time so it's gonna take me much longer but as you can see I did a lot and it start to look pretty here is I'm gonna show you shot from far it this looks gorgeous I like how those kind of like a bushes uh, grass start to come out or tree uh, so it is gonna be gorgeous but it will take me much longer than I thought would be because the canvas a little bit more uh, I would say not pixelated but more uh, like confetti lots of lots of different colors mix which is quality on the end will be much better and more realistic I should say so that's what I'm working every day little bit by little bit and I really want to do drill with you guys this one diamond painting as well a little bit just to show you and uh, one more thing about this canvas that the glue are so strong that the drills is totally not movable if you place the drill that's it you're gonna stay like this it's really really hard it's like it's not pushable you can't move around so um, the glue is strong so it shouldn't be coming out you shouldn't lose your drills but it is beautiful so yes that's what I'm working on it okay guys I'm gonna say goodbye to you right now and if you are new on my channel please don't forget to subscribe and hit that notification bell just in case you want to see more of my videos okie dokie I love you all have a great day or good night